the U.S. almost bombed the moon. So in 1958, the United States did something crazy. They tried to blow up the moon. It was during the height of the space race and the U.S. was desperate to beat the Soviets. They'd managed to put a few satellites into orbit, but the Soviets had beaten them to launch the first satellite, Sputnik 1, into space. And they were way ahead in the space race. The U.S. was so far behind that they needed a miracle to win. And that s when President Eisenhower met with his science team and asked them if it was possible to nuke the moon. Now, this is important. At the time, the U.S. was developing the largest nuke they'd ever made. The plan was to use this nuke to propel a payload of smaller nukes into space and then detonate them on the surface of the moon. But there was a problem. While the explosion blast might have been able to propel a payload into space, the force of hitting the moon's surface would be way too strong and it would probably just vaporize any payload. So instead, they attached a large nuclear device to a rocket and aimed it at the moon. This massive nuke was over 10 times more powerful than the bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki combined, and it was scheduled to be launched on July 1958. But two days before the launch, scientists discovered a flaw in the rocket's guidance system. If the rocket lost control, it could go off course and crash into the US mainland or worse, into the Soviet Union. They needed more time to fix the guidance system but the Air Force wanted to launch the rocket as soon as possible. They were worried that the Soviets would beat them to the punchline if they waited, but in the end, they decided to postpone the launch to fix the guidance system. And this was probably a good thing because as soon as they fixed it, they lost the ability to test the rocket. A few weeks later, another problem was discovered. The nuclear device they had attached to the rocket was unstable and dangerous. It was supposed to detonate as soon as it hit the moon's surface, but now it was giving off dangerous levels of radiation while still in transit. They needed to redesign the whole device, but now no one was sure if they could get it done in time. In the end, the project was cancelled, and the US never tried to nuke the moon. If they had, it is likely that the explosion would have vaporized the surface of the moon and sent huge chunks of debris hurling towards Earth. We would have been bombarded by radioactive meteorites, and the Earth would have been covered in nuclear fallout. So maybe it's for the best that we never nuked the moon. Watch the full video and more in the channel. Like, subscribe, share.